I can't die yet. Uh. Morning, sleepyhead. You're finally up, Shuichi. Kokichi. Huh? What? Me? <laughs> Are you going to ask who am I and where am I? No. What I'm going to ask first is, can you not be this close to me? And my second question is, what are you planning to do now that we are here? Well, you're definitely Shuichi Saihara. And this place is... Hmm, I guess hell. Hell? I shook my head, confused. I looked around. Hmm, I is this... Oh, you're awake? This is the Ultimate Entomologist's research lab. Huh? The Ultimate Entomologist's lab? But why? Ah, oh. oh, I remember. I was attacked by Gonta, and then... That's correct. And the same is true of the rest of us. We were all seized by Gonta, and brought here. Um... But Shuichi is the only one who got knocked out. Only Shuichi, eh? <laughs> well... On one hand, I am glad that he didn't hurt any of you. But on the other hand, how come Shuichi is the only one who got knocked out? Also, where are the rest? I mean, where's Kirumi, Himiko and Angie? And the rest, where are they? By the way... Gonta apologized for that. Apparently he couldn't slow down in time when he tried to grab you. Why? What is this anyway? Why did Gonta do this? It's because of that guy. He was provoked by that guy. My eyes followed where Tsumugi was pointing. <laughs> There's no use trying to escape. Gonta will just catch you up. Gonta will just catch you again. Hmm. Alrighty then. Well, before we talk to Kokichi, let's let's see what they have to say. Are you alright? Why did I have to beat this room? It gives me the creeps. Mm. As I thought. I do not think Gonta would ever decide on his own to capture us. What is Kokichi trying to accomplish by taking advantage of Gota's naivete? Now I can think of one thing. We must do it. Regardless, I cannot forgive his nonchalant attitude about using people. Yeah, I cannot agree with that either. Say. What are Kokichi and Gonta's true aim? Getting us all together in this room. I couldn't stop Gonta. Not even with my new Aikido. His power is far greater than my new Aikido. Uh, well, that certainly blows. But I hope you're gonna be more prepared next time, Tenko. No. Is this your doing, Kokichi? Did they have Gonta kidnap us? <laughs> <laughs> He's so simple-minded. Um... As soon as I told him that everyone who hates bugs was trying to get rid of them, he started crying and said that he would get you guys to love bugs. Or something like that. So that means... And that's why we're all here. Welcome to the mandatory insect meet and greet. This isn't just Gonta's doing. You used Gonta in order to have us all here so we can talk. Or show us our videos. Isn't that right? Oh, Gonta thought of the name. So if you don't like it, voice your complaints to him. That's terrible. You're terrible. You tricked Gonta. Right? <laughs> Isn't it great? Only an evil supreme leader like me could do something so evil. Kokichi. Kichi, why are you doing this? Oh, I thought we could throw your for ourselves a little screen party with all our videos. See? With all you here, exchanging our multi videos wouldn't be that difficult at all. <laughs> and I wanna see your videos too, so I figured we could all binge watch them together. Please wait! Do you know what will happen if you do that? Um, um everyone will know their motive and killing will be more likely to happen. But but I like playing on mean difficulty. Also, I don't run from battles in RPGs either. 
I want to win this kidding game, so I'm not going to run from it. I'm going to crush it. How exciting. That'll be way less boring, don't you think? Huh? What the hell does that mean? See? I tried to warn you guys. I told you we shouldn't cooperate with each other. <laughs> Plus, if I'm going to do this, then I gotta enjoy myself and just go all the way. If the thought of playing a death game doesn't excite you, you'll never win, understand? Strangely, I could detect no evil in his smile as he said that. When it was an innocent smile, like a frolicking child. Although, perhaps, it's just another lie. Hey! Thank you for waiting. Gonta, bring Himiko and Anji. Gonta, you better not have not done anything bad to them. The same way you did to Shuichi. Accidental or intentional. What? Huh? Himiko and Anji too. Aww. Oh man. And I was about to take a break too. I just finished all the pet work. Uh... Yeah. What's the meaning of this? Himiko! Himiko, are you okay? My saliva makes injuries heal faster. Uh, Tenko, you do realize that if you're gonna attempt that, you're gonna you're gonna drown her in a pool of saliva, and it won't help like at all. Piece of cake. Does your face hurt? Do you want me to spit on your face and make it feel better? Just imagine Tenko actually spitting on the Himiko's face. And then she rubs her hand on her face. That's just talking. Stop it. No. Hey. Hey, Kanta. Are these the only ones you've brought back from the gym? Mm. Oh, Kirumi at gym, but she tell Gonta she too busy. Hmm. Huh? And you just let her go? Atua has spoken. Atua says Kirumi fulfills any requests someone makes of her, like a mommy. Hey. Uh, she's not a mom though. Wait, what request? I requested that she sew the curtains. I don't think even Gonda can disturb her. You requested her to sew the curtains, you say? Sorry! Sorry, not even Gonta strong enough to overcome Kirumi. Hmm. Hmm. Well, I guess at least one of you is worthy of being called an ultimate. By the way. Well, nothing we can do about her. Are the others still hiding somewhere? Um. Oh, Gonta see Mew, but. Gonta's face get red hot, so Gonta no could bring her. Oh, <laughs> you like Mew, Gonta? Mm -hmm. Your face got hot. You mean you were hot on our trail, right? <sighs> no, um, she used her, what she call it, secret woman pot weapon, and then, <laughs> um, pretty interesting that even Gonta can fall for that. Actually, he couldn't get Kirumi, and he couldn't get Mew either? Huh. Anyway, this is enough people, right? Insect meet and greet is off to a smashing start! Maybe. Yeah, sure. This is good enough. We should move on to the main event anyway. You can't! Gonta, don't be deceived! He just used you to abduct us all! Huh? Huh? Really? Gonta, I do want to have faith in you. But you're just making it very hard for us, goddammit. At least if you were aware of Kokichi's intentions, then I would feel much better, even if you still abducted us. But you just followed Kokichi like a dog. Nuh-uh. Nuh-uh. No, this is for the insect meet and greet. I like Bugs even more than you do, Gonta. Huh? Oh, more than Gonta? Amazing. You like Bugs that much? Oh dear, he, he would appear further argument is a useless endeavor. Hey, hey! No, Gonta, go ahead and teach them just how wonderful bugs are. I gotta run an, er uh, an errand. I gotta run an errand. Well, I'll be back. Don't need to leave, okay? Uh, where? Kokichu, where are you going? Alright! If they try to leave, it means you gotta really show them why bugs are so great. Hmm. Hmm, hmm. Got it. Could it be. W wait, you're leaving? Yeah. Of course. Someone's got to break into your rooms to get the goods. Pfft. Wow. 
<laughs> Not picking is a cinch for an evil supreme leader like me. What? What? You're going to enter a girl's room without permission? If I must. Since I must be the one to take care of this. With my talent, Kokichi, I will stop. You're so dumb. Yeah, yeah. I don't have time to listen to some robot. Um... Let's see. It's exactly 9 p.m. right now. I should be back by night time. Yep. Have fun with the bugs till then. Have fun with the bugs. Kokichi then left the classroom. <laughs> it appears we are caught in Kokichi's trap. What should we do? Well, what should we do? At this rate, you will end up as a motive video screening party. <laughs> My new Aikido is no match for Konta's superhuman strength either. Everyone! We still have a chance when Kokichi comes back. That's when I'll take care of this. Everyone, please just please just endure it until then. Huh? P endure it? Wait, 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 hold on, hold on a second. Let's let's not jump to any violence here. We don't need to add that to our worries here. Everyone, play nice! Uh, uh, okay, now we start the fun fun insect meet and greet. When I had first woken up, Kokichi told me this was hell. It appears that wasn't a lie. Uh, oh god! The incredible specimens each gave off the appearance of vigor and vitality. And they were exactly as vig vigorous as they looked. Oh god! With our escape route blocked off, all we could do was run around the room in panic. Conta, no! I mean, at least don't release them all at once! The nighttime announcement played, but it didn't save us. The insect meet and greet continued without mercy. What happened, Kokichi? You said you'd be back by nighttime. Ah, oh no! Himiko is being buried alive by insects! Oh, oh, oh no! Himiko! H Himiko, hold on! The more you yell, the more bugs can get into your mouth. Finally, when our bodies were completely exhausted and sleep was nearly upon us. He finally came back. Whoa! Whoa! Uh, ugh, there are bugs everywhere! How nest I mean, how nice! Did you bring the videos? Oh. Hmm. Oh. Oh, you came back, Kokichi. Come, we have fun. Everyone, play We're nice. We're gonna have so much fun. Hmm. You know, as much as I love to do that, maybe we should call it a day, huh? See, the bug, the bugs look really tired, and the gentleman knows how knows to do things in moderation, you know. You right. Oh. Gonta understand. Hey, hey! So you clean up while I take care of business with the others. Kokichi's hands were full of several cubs' pads. Uh, and that surely was hell on earth. Himiko, are you alright? Yeah? Yeah? What's going on? The last thing I remember is Gonta releasing the bugs. Uh, well. Thank God that you're all okay. No bug stings or anything on you. Though, I think I'm seeing another bug inside your hair. Let me just get it off of you. <gasps> Kameko! Hey! <laughs> so that's why you were hiding this whole entire time. Man, I miss you so much, Kameko. Did she pass out from here? Well, I guess I, I can understand that. Ugh. Oh, so, she, so he really did go get the cubs pants. No, I don't want to check the books. I don't have time to check books here. <laughs> what a divine time! My island is full of creepy crawlers. This many bugs doesn't bug me. 
Ha! Good one, Angie. Good one. Mm. Should I check Gonta? Let me just uh, check Kibo first. Everyone! Thank you for enduring it, everyone. This is the last chance. Uh, Kibo, please leave the rest to me. What do you mean, leave the rest to you? What are you gonna do? Uh, Kyo! You're not feeling well. Can we help, man? How terrifying. And so, we have escaped from the Maw of Hell itself somehow. Aw, oh, man, poor Kyo. No. Okay. Yeah, Tenko is not amused, like, at all, either. Ah, uh, no. Uh, still okay. As a disciple of New Aikido, it will take more than this to break my composure. Hey! Ah, oh, Tenko, there's a big old bug on your back. <laughs> Wait! C calm down, Tenko! I frankly swatted the bug off her. <sighs> Not cool, Kokichi. Not cool. No. It's okay. There are bugs everywhere. It's no wonder you. Degenerate male! I don't need help from some male! Clearly, I haven't trained enough. As soon as I escape from this place, I will return to Master and resume my training. Yeah, you're definitely gonna have to be to be even more prepared next time we meet Hell on Earth. <laughs> Featuring bugs. Everyone. Well, everyone have fun time meeting and greeting the bugs? Uh, okay. Uh, yeah, I suppose I did. Wow! Good! Now everyone likes bugs. More bugs hatching real soon. Let's have fun time meeting and greeting new bugs. Yoo-hoo! You guys okay? You all look like drowned sewer rats. Huh. Cause you're late! Wait, you said you'd be back by night time, but it's already 11 p.m. now. My bad. Sorry, I ran into an unexpected snafu. But... But, look! <laughs> Ghost pets. Gotta catch him all. I even got the pet belonging to the people who aren't here. You even stole theirs. <laughs> <laughs> no, everyone can watch their motive video. Oh my! I said we don't want to. How exciting! Well, can't play tonight. Getting sleepy, so let's start already. Hey, start what? Oh, don't you see, Gonta? <laughs> What do you think we are gonna start here? Well, you know. Oh, don't worry about it, Gonta. Just keep watch so these guys don't. That's enough. That's it. I want you to do as you please. Mm hmm. Hmm. I also. I didn't want to use this unless I absolutely had to. It eats up a lot of my electricity. Uh, eats up a lot of your electricity. We must do it. But that's neither here nor there. I'll stop you right here, right now. Kibo, no! It's too powerful! You cannot use your final form! Huh? K Kibo, what are you going to do? Oh god! Oh god, he's channeling his fighting spirit again! Still glaring at Kokichi, Kibo slowly reached a hand behind his ear. And spun the mechanical parts there. He's lighting up? Is he gonna self-destruct or... No, uh, it can be. It's like the sound of a tape or something. One moment, please. I'm rewinding the tape right now. Rewinding the tape? The tape? Right there. Kibo shouted out and pushed his palm against his ear. That's when... Is this your doing, Kokichi? Did you have Gonta kidnap us? Was that my voice? <laughs> He's so simple-minded. As soon as I told him that everyone who hates bugs was trying to get rid of them, he started crying and said that he would get you guys to love bugs, or something like that. <laughs> Kokichi, I think he has some explaining to do in front of Gonta. Could this be... How about this? So, what do you think? You just saw my audio recording function for the first time. What? D did you really just pawn out an audio recorder like it's some kind of secret weapon? 
actually. Really? It's a cassette tape? In this day and age? <laughs> as long as it works, I guess. Huh? But it's metal tape, you know. Wait, why? The sound quality isn't the issue here. Hmm? Let's just put this aside now. More importantly, it seems to have worked. You can forgive. Kokichi, what do you mean? You not like bugs? Oh, man. And now it's boring. Was it lie? You say we get them to understand how amazing bugs are. Was that a lie? <laughs> <laughs> I don't lie to you. I love bugs. From the bottom of my heart. Alright. Oh, so it's not a lie. Then Gonta happy. Let's have fun with bugs all night. Uh, Gonta. Hey, bugs! Who want to pet more bugs? Huh? Eh? Kokichi, I think you better run while you can. Everyone! We must run while we still can. <laughs> yep, my sentiments exactly. <gasps> Wait, we need to take back our cub's pads first. Teko snatched the cub's pad from Kokichi. No. Oh. Then we all ran out of the lab. <sighs> After leaving the room, I could still hear the muffled buzzing and Kokichi screaming. Hmm. We might be curses by tomorrow morning. Um, no we won't be. I mean, we did escape from hell now. I mean, how much worse can it get, Himiko? It's plain to see. Don't joke about that. What if it happens? It's just plain possible. So, how do we return these cuss pads back to their rightful owners? Jeez. Hmm, if only the mother cubs were here, I'm sure they'd help us. Yeah, now we cannot tell whose is their pads without actually checking them. Oh! <laughs> Monodon to the rescue! Hey, what's up? Hmm. Oh. It's just you. It's fine. The others are asleep. If you need something, I can help you. Uh, um. um it's about the cubs pads. Kokichi brought them to us and Okey dokey. I simply need to return them. I will. Return each one to your respective rooms, you bastards. Ah. Uh, he left. Oh, that was abrupt. Yeah, that was surely easy. But, but out of all of them, we can probably trust that one, right? Well then. Shall we go back to our dorms? It is well past night time. Yeah, I think I have had enough of this day. <laughs> <laughs> That's chill. We have the magic show tomorrow. You're right. Because of all this, we couldn't do a rehearsal. But I'm sure I'll be a divine show. Yeah, I am pretty excited about this. We'll be waiting for you to come watch. Hmm. <laughs> we'll be waiting, she says. It's Himiko's show, not yours. Uh, um... I suppose it's alright. Yeah. I mean, let's not uh, have this moment we had ruin tomorrow's magic show. I just remembered. I wasn't able to train with Kaito today. Uh, too bad. We can do it tomorrow night, though. No. Well, no training? Pfft. Lazy. It's not like I'll ever see him again or anything. We're not from all the commotion. We dragged ourselves back to our rooms. Hmm. Hmm. It's close to midnight now. Tomorrow is a busy day. I should get some sleep. I collapsed onto the bed and quickly fell asleep. I need a miracle. You pray, right? While you are working, sleeping and gambling. But miracles happen every day. For example, do you know what the odds of the earth existing are? The same as a tornado blowing through a junkyard and assembling a working car. That's a miracle. That's why us being alive on Earth is a miracle. Hmm. Well, you may be right. 
I mean, actually, you are right. I mean, if Earth didn't have the right conditions for sustaining human life because of how the solar system formed, like, billion years ago, then we wouldn't even exist. That and also the moon and other factors. All kinds of miracles happen every day. Life is made of a lot of, of little miracles. But whenever a miracle does happen, it just gets chalked up as fate or destiny or whatever. Be grateful for the miracles that have already happened instead of hoping for new ones. If you do that, you should be able to enjoy miracles, right? Rise and shine, or shine! Uh, again, no love key scene. Why is it that I cannot get any at this point? Also, where is Monosuke? Rise and shine, or shine. It is now oh. 8 a.m. Okay, uh, okay. Can you can you keep some distance from the screen, please? This is an official announcement from the Ultimate Academy. It's 8 a.m., so wake up. Ah. Oh, he left. Monosuke is so impatient. Hmm, he's been cranky lately. So it's making him impatient. Oh, well, no shit. Hmm, I, I don't like impatient men. Let's get along. I want to get along with Manasuke. All right. Oh, it's a little early. But I'll go ahead and do the nighttime announcement too. And that's that. It'll be 10 p.m. later. And that's that. <laughs> oh, it's too early. Your impatience is trying to warp time and space. So long. Farewell. Yeah, I mean, don't don't fucking change the gravity while we're at it. Jesus Christ. Hmm. Today is the day of Himiko's magic show. But insect fiasco yesterday, and now this. Do we really have time to be doing this stuff? I don't know. Ask ask the same question whenever we do a free time event. Well, I suppose I shouldn't think about it so much. I'll just go go. I'll just go to the gym for now. Yeah, we definitely should. Let's just enjoy this wonderful morning that we're gonna have with Himiko's magic! Also, let me just uh, see about some stuff here. Tsumugi is outside, we can definitely talk to her before we go to the gym. And also Kibo, and also Kirumi. Yeah, that's nice. Kirumi, I don't even know, <laughs> like, have you heard what happened last night? I'm actually pretty glad that you weren't, you didn't, you didn't get captured and all that. You didn't get abducted by Gonta, and you had to suffer the same way as we do. Hey, Tsumugi. 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 Good morning, Tsumugi. Good morning. Are you okay? Are you okay? You look a bit sick. Yeah. It definitely has to do with what happened last night. Like, bugs flying everywhere for like, two fucking hours. I mean... How long would it take to pick, like, lockpick 16 doors and take their cu- like, cubs pants? Oh my... Yeah, it's just, the sounds of those bugs buzzing is still in my head. Even after I went to bed, I just kept hearing it, so I didn't get that much sleep. That's... Uh, that must have been rough. It definitely was rough. Gunther would be so sad to hear it, but I like bugs even less now. I'm glad there aren't any bugs outside of Gonta's lab. Oh wait, are there? Oh. Well, Gonta did say that he thought he would saw a really tiny bug once. Yeah. Oh yeah, he did say that. But, but even when Gonta's 20-06-625 vision, he could only barely see it, right? So, isn't it possible he was just plain mistaken? Hmm... I don't know. No. no, actually, I really hope he was mistaken. Oh my... Yeah, I'm so over bugs. I'm just going to sh I'm just going to forget last night and enjoy the magic show. You're right. Yeah. All right! The show's in the gym, right? I'm gonna go on ahead. Yeah, sure thing. It's muggy. You enjoy the magic show and all that. Man, you you are still working at this rock over here? Jesus Christ! How long how long does it take to 
to to do whatever you have to do with that rock. You've been working at it for days by now. Hey Kibo, what's up? Kibo! <laughs> Kibo! Hey Kibo! Good morning! Yes. Good morning, yo, yo, Kibo! My boy, Kibo! Good morning, Chiji. How are you feeling today? I'm still sore from the events of last night. Okay. Mm, I'm fine. Are you alright? 100%. Yep, yeah, I'm fine. I'll recharge the electricity that I used on my recording function. You did say that he uses a lot of electricity, didn't you? I mean, that sort of stuff uses a lot of electricity. I do have to say that you are definitely an ultimate robot, but at the same time, you should definitely think about how, like, about the consumption of that audio recording tape. It, it definitely has, like, a high consumption there. If it takes so much just to record an audio. Even so, I am very happy that I was finally able to use my functions to help everyone. I'm definitely happy about that too, Kibo. Kibo's recording function is not exactly a revolutionary technology, but it did help a lot. Thank you. Yeah, thank you, Kibo. You really earned your title of Ultimate Robot. Well, of course. Oh, it was nothing, really. If you ever need my help for anything, please don't hesitate to ask. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, I sure will. Um... So, the magic show is starting soon, yes? Everyone has probably gathered in the gym already. We should get going as well. Yeah, we definitely should. Although I do have to wonder what the others are doing. We shall definitely check on Kirumi now. And I don't even know where Maki and... Hmm. Yeah, I do have to wonder what Ryoma is doing right now. And also Maki. Maki is probably... Near her, near her lab once again. She's, she's not letting anyone in. I do have to wonder where Ryoma is. If he is actually gonna, if he's actually gonna show up at the magic show too. I mean that would be pretty, pretty sweet. Mm, where is Kirumi right now? Is she like? I think I also saw her. Yeah, she should be like right over here or something. Mm. Unless she's hiding somewhere. Kirumi, are you hiding from me, my dear? Uh, ah, there you are. Lovely morning, Miss Tojo. Kirumi. <laughs> Shinji, what the fuck is wrong with you? Kirumi! Good morning, yo! Good morning. Everyone has already gathered for the show. Hmm. Oh, is that right? I suppose everyone's looking forward to it. Yep. Everyone is definitely looking forward to it. Me? I am super thrilled about it. That is correct. Mio seems particularly excited. Her eyes were lit up like a child's. <laughs> yeah. I can imagine. I mean I did sir I did see her pretty excited like yesterday. I mean I am super I am super duper omega thrilled to see a good display of magic from Himiko. For like the first time too. She's that excited, huh? Well, I'd be lying if I said I wasn't excited too. It seems as if... Yeah! By the way, it would seem that some outrageous event transpired last night. Hey! Yeah, Kokichi tricked Gonta into going along with his motive video screening plan. But thanks to Kibo, we put a stop to it. It's okay. I see. I see. So K Kokichi truly does intend to oppose, oppose us. Please, go ahead. No matter. Let's go inside. Everyone is waiting. Yep. And you're gonna enjoy the magic show too, Kirumi. You have no choice. You're not gonna you're not gonna work at all here. Whoa, this is even nicer than I thought it'd be. Yeah. <laughs> Alright! We're here! Move out, move out of the way, people! I have dibs on the front seat to see Himiko's magic. Yaha! Welcome to our magic show. What do you think? Isn't it divine? Okay. Yeah, it is. I didn't think you would have a real stage set up. Did you and Himiko do all this? No, no. No, no. This would have been impossible with just the two. I got others to help us. I got others to help us. 
Kaito and Kibo help carry equipment from Himiko's research lab. I decided to stay with Bakirumi's through the curtains. Thanks, Bitu Atua. Everyone is so nice. Atua deserves all the credit. <laughs> Atua deserves all the credit? No. Uh, shouldn't everyone who worked on it get the credit? Oh! No, well, I didn't ask you to help because I didn't know what you'd be useful, you'd be useful for. That's... Did you really have to say that? I mean, come on, Angie. Uh, how can you how can you say that to your future husband? Unless the only good thing is that he is a good husband, but other than that, he just got jack shit. I don't know. I don't know. Anyway, just sit tight. Once we're done preparing, we'll start right away. Huh? Done preparing? You're not ready yet. Uh, yep. The start of the show needs to settle her her nerves. Oh. Well, can we help with that? The star of the show requires mental preparations. Uh, here we go! Let me hug you. Uh, don't worry, you you will do fantastic in whatever you are gonna show us. And oh my God, you're you're just vibrating here, Jesus! You can create so much energy with uh, with the vibrations that you are offering us. She's shaking like a leaf. <laughs> oh. Uh. Okay, well, what do you have over here? We have a water tank? What are we gonna use the water tank on? I mean, I guess that's part of- Gonta, idiot! Gonta's so sorry about yesterday. Gonta not know why he act that way. Gonta too forceful. Still have long way before Gonta call himself true gentleman. It's not your fault. It's Kokichi's fault for tricking you. Degenerate males. Yeah. As much as you have been a bad boy yesterday, Gonta, <clears throat> I guess I'll offer you a hug too. To feel much better. Now you know how much of a meanie Kokichi is. Even so, I think you need to seriously reflect on what you did. You go your gullible mind will eventually lead you down the wrong path in life. Mm. Gonta be more careful next time. Um, so, what happened to Kokichi? Um, After insect meet and greet, Kokichi's mouth starts to bubble, then he pass out. <laughs> oh, I see. He might not make it to the show then. Hmm, I guess not. What is this? This is way bigger than I thought. I imagine a plane everyday stage. Uh... I guess all the thoughts in my plane all head are just plain. Plain. Again, you mentioning the word plain doesn't help you, Tsumogi. I, I'm, I'm sure you will have your moment to shine soon enough. Mew? So good. <laughs> what is this device? I've never seen something like this before. This is a first for me. <laughs> how, is it, how is it even a first for you? It's a, it's a water tank. A water tank? I'm getting excited! Really, really excited! Jesus Christ! Oh my! Just don't let her be in the front seat. Tenko, you're trembling! I told you many times that the twin loves all of his creations. Hmm. <laughs> what do you mean, all his creations? That's way too much love! What about Monokuma, huh? Does the twin love him too? So. Of course, so Miss Mai must love Monokuma, so their love will reach him. Eh, uh, eh, uh, no. You gotta be kidding me! Shut up already! No one can feel love. They can feel any emotions at all. <laughs> and yet, I felt a strange pain in my chest after you just said that. <laughs> <laughs> you know, lately I've been having weird pains in my joints and my lower body. Are you okay? Isn't that a symptom of gout? Uh, no wonder she's feeling excited about this this whole thing. Uh, Kibo? This is... this is quite a professional looking set. Hmm. However, considering how unsettled Himiko is, we might not get to witness for ourselves the skill of the ultimate magician. How unfortunate. No, I mean... Yeah, she, she just needs a little bit of mental preparation before this, but she's gonna do it. By the way, can I ask you something, Angie? 
Feel free. Hmm? What? Um, when you're alone with Himiko, what do you guys talk about? <laughs> well, just normal things. So divine! Food, sweets, our nails, and how to get Atua's bath water at a discount rate. Hey! Th that, that was one that's not normal at all. Atua's bath? And she can be quite a handful. I wonder if Himiko can, can handle her. Uh, I don't know about that one. <clears throat> Either way. We managed to complete the preparations in time. I hope everyone enjoys the show. Okay. You helped out too, Kirumi, right? You helped out too, Kirumi? Did you do did you do the sewing? Well, didn't they just say that before? You complete every task you're given, don't you? No wonder you're the ultimate maid. But right now, you're just an audience member like everyone else. So let's enjoy the show. Yes, I shall do just that. Alright! You deserve to have some fun too, dammit. No maid duty selfless devotion for at least half an hour or so. Yeah, that's the spirit. Kyo! Say. Those fish in the tank above, are those truly... Wait, fish? Where? Is it alright to use something so dangerous? What are you talking about? What fish? Uh, uh, water tank? It looks like there's fish inside. Is this part of the trick? Hey, Himiko, can we talk about this for a second? Could it be... Himiko... Are you a bit... nervous? <laughs> j j j just a little bit. Certainly doesn't look like just a little bit. Um, yeah, no. Don't worry, Himiko. You... You'll be fantastic there on stage. I mean, you are the ultimate mage, after all. Of course, if your... MP is not high enough... You can... You can give up on the water tank and... You know... Do something else? Maybe? Cause the magic I'll be performing today is the Extreme Water Magic Underwater Escape Act. Underwater Escape Act? I've never successfully cast it before. It's pretty difficult, so I'm a little nervous. Huh? You've never cast it before? Hmm. And today... In order to raise the stakes, there's a time limit. If I don't escape from the tank within the time limit, the pandas will be dropped in. I'll be pureed. P pureed? P pureed? Uh, this is looking a little dangerous. Yeah, just a teeny bit dangerous. Mm, but not something that Himiko can't handle, right? The water is cloudy, so I can't see very clearly, but I do see fish swimming around. Those are all piranhas, huh? They don't look like normal piranhas. Hmm. Uh... Where do those piranhas even come from? Those piranhas were in my research lab. And you said we should use them for the show. Uh, no. Wait, piranhas are way too dangerous. Uh, Tenko. Himiko! Himiko, please reconsider! They're piranhas! They're nothing like lasagna! With my magic... No need to worry. I'll... Did you just compare piranhas to lasagna? I'll instantly kill all of the piranhas with my magic. Huh? You're going to kill them? I thought this was an escape trick. Um... Himiko, are you serious? I mean, if you don't feel confident enough, it's alright, you know. You, you don't have to force yourself to do it. 
And let's not forget that we're talking about Piranha here. There's no way I can stop now. Since Atua's watching the show and all. No! There's no such thing as Atua! Angie has brainwashed you! What was that? You don't believe in my magic? Well... Uh... I... I can do it. I'm a skilled young girl. Cause I am a mage. She psyched herself up and headed straight to the water tank. Of course, I believe in your magic. You're my precious friend. Tango. Yoo-hoo! Ready, Hibiko? Did you say your prayers and use the bathroom? Mm. Yeah, I said my prayers and went pee. Yeah! <laughs> now let's get the show started! It's starting already, but not but not everyone is here yet. Maki, Kokichi, Ryoma, and Kaito aren't here. What happened to Kaito? I thought he'd be here for sure. I wonder if something happened. Maki, Kokichi, Ryoma, Kaito. They are not here. Himiko is actually gonna do it. I don't know about this. Thank you, Atua, for being with us today. Boo! Boo! You're supposed to thank us first! Ha 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 ha! I present to you the mysterious, the miraculous, the amazing Himiko! <laughs> The, the, the magic I will perform today is the extreme water magic. Uh, uh, underwater escape act. Whoa! You go, Himiko. If you would please turn your attention to the water tank in front of you. When the timer above the stage starts, Himiko will enter the water tank. Once she's in the tank, her assistant, me, will draw the curtain in front of the tank. After 60 seconds have passed on the timer, a separate suspended tank will open and drop in a school of piranhas. Oh my goodness. Um, sorry if, I, sorry if I'm interrupting here, Angie, but how about we use something else? Like, I don't know, uh... Puppies? I'm uh, I'm sure it would feel much magical that way. Plus the puppies do need some bath as well. After the piranhas have fallen and the curtain is opened. If by some miracle Himiko has been gobbled up, please give a big round of applause. Just kidding! It's a joke! Are you feeling all right? I'm concerned about Himiko. She is not responding properly to Angie's jokes. Mm. Gunta, worry. Gunta have a bad feeling. <laughs> Atua, please protect Himi. No! Wait, what am I doing praying to Atua? That's Angie's shtick! <gasps> well, I guess you could pray to some other god. <laughs> well then, let's begin. The amazing Himiko's magic show! In her typical high-pitched voice, Himiko made her announcement that started the timer. Then, she took a breath and dove into the water tank. Okay! I'm closing the curtain! Angie closed the curtain, obscuring the water tank from view. Uh, okay, 50 seconds. We stared silently, waiting. I clenched my fists nervously, my palms damp with sweat. Kimiko is still not out! 40 seconds. She went in mere moments ago. 30 seconds. Well, well do you think she's alright? Uh, 
Gonta's starting to worry. Should we do something? Yeah, um... She, she still hasn't come out! Are you sure she's okay? Yeah, uh, how about we open the curtain right now? Can we please? Gonta can't take it anymore! Gonta cried out, leaped out of the, his seat, and... Wait, Gonta? Uh... Ran up to the stage. Oh, you can't do that! We're still in the middle of the show! Uh... Yeah, sorry, Angie, but we're ending it here. We, 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 can't, we can't do this. Magic show is over. But, but if Gonta does nothing, piranhas will eat Himiko! Huh? Um, less than 10 seconds remain. I don't care if it ruins the trick. Just come out. This stress is bad for my heart. Yeah, it's bad for my heart, too. I can't take this. Himiko, get out of the water now! Gonta, help her! When the timer hit zero, the buzzer went off, and then... Oh god, the bottom of the suspended tank swung open, and the murky water and shadowy shapes inside. Fell straight into the water tank, Himiko was swimming in. Oh god, Himiko! Are you still there? Huh? Huh? I hope that you escaped. Look! The piranhas! Hurry! The curtains! Open the curtains already! Got it! I'm opening it now! When Angie pulled apart the curtains, we witnessed an unbelievable sight. Oh lord, no! <laughs> Ryoma! Oh god, Ryoma, no! It took a few moments for all of us to even process it. But then again, perhaps we weren't trying to process it. Yoma! No! Perhaps we didn't want to acknowledge it. Great, huh? Uh. The old, the magnificent underwater escape. Yeah? A body has been discovered. Everyone, please gather in the gym. Yeah? Yeah? A body in the gym? <laughs> Ah! <laughs> 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 <laughs>